What's up, world? This your boy, your one and only Money Moves with your boy, your one and only MIMF 2.0, where we strive to make you to become the best financial circumstances you can be in. We try to put everybody there, okay? So before we get into this video, make sure you guys please go ahead and like and subscribe to this YouTube channel so you guys can stay updated with all my new content that I come out with. Well, today, we're going to talk about five types of women men should stay away from who can ruin your financial success. Okay? So a lot of people... Including myself, back in the past, would just go around dating women, dating women, dating women. I didn't care about getting to know them. And I basically just want to get in the draws, you know what I'm saying? Their whole any women to no kind of standards or anything like that. So, today... I'm gonna tell you some, some 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 types of traits you need to steer away from, steer clean away from. So, so type number one: women. The women you need to stay away from is type number one is the woman that you always see on social media going out to the club. Okay, personally, I don't do no clubbing, you know, so, I, and the only way I'm in the club, if, if I'm paid to be there, you know, but a lot of these ladies, you see them week in, week out, they're clubbing, been clubbing for years, but if you want to get with a woman who who's used to going out to the club, all the time then you're going to end up with a lot of drama a lot of heartache a lot of pain you know what I'm saying because and she wants to party you know what I'm saying and nine times out of ten a lady who's clubbing is going to run into a lot of guys in the club try to get free drinks you know what I'm saying probably drinks a lot come back home drunk argumentative, you know what I'm saying? If you, especially if you don't club or y'all ain't club together, you man, stay away from a woman who clubs, man, because she's gonna fucking hurt you. She's gonna hurt your pockets. Um, so the second type of woman that you should stay away from is a woman who has children. Um, back in the day, I used to date women with children. You know what I'm saying? I'm like, I'm, I'm messed up. I know she's going to have them good food stuff. she got them kids and stuff. But dating women with children will financially hurt you in the long run. You know what I'm saying? Because not only are you taking care of her, you're taking care of children that are not even yours. You got to make sure, you know what I'm saying, they eat. And uh, they got new clothes. You can't just go and just be with a woman who who got children. Like she will not have time for you, and she will always nine times out of ten needs you to do something for her and her kids, which will hurt your pockets in the long run. So, if you guys are making money, you got money, you on a way to making some money. Stay away from women with children. Number three, the third. Third type of woman you want to stay stay away from is the woman who's thirty plus, thirty plus, and haven't got married. They haven't got married. Don't have n nothing good going for themselves. They're staying with their parents. You know, what I'm saying they're looking for people to help them out and stuff. Um. You want to stay away from women who 
or 30 plus and having who don't look bad, you know what I'm saying? Look decent, you know what I'm saying? But still ain't got married. You definitely want to stay away from women 30 plus. Because what's going to happen is she's not the young, fruitful woman that from a young 18 to 27 year old that you can get from one of them. She's going to be being that been around the block a couple of times. And obviously if she looks that good and nobody haven't married her or took up the responsibility to be with her and it never works and her, they check out her dating history you need to stay away from her, man. She ain't no good because nobody wants her. Nobody can deal with her. So, the third thing, your fourth trait of woman you will you will definitely want to stay away from is uh the section government assistant women the government the reason why i say stay away from women who use government assistant and section a housing and stuff like that because they don't even know financially what to do themselves you know what i'm saying so you're going to get in a situation with a woman where you're trying to do everything financially which if she's young enough you can